Let's look at how to create an open-ended and fixed length recurring donation. An open-ended recurring donation is when a donor agrees to give on a regular basis for an unspecified time period. For example, Lisa Shaw is a donor who responded to our fundraising appeal. She'd like to donate $50 by check on the 10th of each month. From the recurring donations tab, click new. Find Lisa using the contact lookup. Enter $50 for the amount, select 10 for day of month, then click save. The new recurring donation record is ready to track Lisa's donations. NPSP generates an open installment opportunity for each month. When we receive Lisa's check, we'll simply close the open opportunity and NPSP generates the next installment automatically. Now let's look at a fixed length recurring donation. A fixed length recurring donation is when a donor chooses to donate for a specific number of installments. A new donor, Roberto Chase, has pledged $1,250 each quarter, every three months for one year. He'll pay using a bank transfer on the 15th day of every third month. From the recurring donations tab, click new. Find Roberto using the contact lookup. Enter $1,250 for the amount. This time, set the recurring type to fixed and the number of plan installments to four. For recurring period, we'll want to select advanced so we can specify every three months as the installment period. Enter the rest of the information about Roberto's donation and click save. The new recurring donation record is all set to track Roberto's quarterly donation. NPSP generates an open installment opportunity for each quarter. When we've received Roberto's bank transfer and closed the current open opportunity, NPSP generates the next installment automatically. Check out the NPSP documentation to learn more about recurring donations. Thanks for watching.